I see bag around like that. My best suit is in it. Throw it over your port shoulder and full speed ahead. Aye, aye. for the bridegroom. <laughs> hey! Good morning. What do you want? We'd like to get a room, please. All right. What kind of a room do you want? And we'd like to see your floor plan, please. Floor plan? Yes, sir. We'd like a room with a southern explosion. Not explosion, exposure. Oh. I just... you justice? Well, say, this is Muggsy Long over to the Mariner's Rest. Got a ceremony I want you to perform. Me? I'm going to be married. Sure, she's conscious. Oh, yeah, all right. I'll pick up the license. Come over right away, will you? Hey, you What seems to be the trouble? It seems to be the trouble. <laughs> She's crying with happiness. She's going to be married. Who's the lucky fellow? I am. Okay, 
Can you beat that? What? What a terrible cat's after me. Remember, love is blind. Come, Stan. Let's relax and have a little game of pool. Cat's after me. Mm. Overstepping your bounds. Oh, oh please don't! Run out of me, will you? Well, I'll put don't, you away. Stop it, young lady. Right here, that's what I get. No, 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 Let's go. 
wrong key. If I ever get my hands on you! Well, that's that. Let's go get something to eat. You got any money? So I gave it to you. Haven't you got it? Yes, I, I left it in the hotel room. Oh. Now what are we going to do? Here we are without a diamond on the verge of starvation. Gee, it looks like a tough winter. Tough? If we don't get something to eat, we won't live till winter. Hey there! Hello, Harry! Well, well, well. Well, Ollie. Harry! Gee, I haven't seen you in ages. No. My friend, Mr. Laurel, Mr. Bernard. How do you do? Now, what are you doing? Oh, I'm doing fine, Ollie. I'm on a little fight stadium down here. Well, I'm cleaning up. Gee, that's great. How's things by you? Oh, just as usual. What's the matter? You up against it? In a very large manner. Gee, that's tough, is it? Sure is. Well, don't pay for it. Tell the he doesn't mean the steak. He means our condition. Well, I didn't know. I thought he was talking about the <laughs> Oh! That hurts. Say, Alan, I can throw 50 bucks your way tonight. 50 bucks? 50 bucks. How? How would you like to go four rounds in a preliminary fight? Great. <laughs> okay. Meet me tonight at the stadium at 7 o'clock. I'll be there. <laughs> Harry. Uh could you advance me a little change on account? Oh, why, sure. How much do you want? Oh, uh, about $60. Here, you may as well take the whole 50. Don't forget tonight. Right on, on the dot. <laughs> well, good morning. Good morning. How do you do, sir? How do you do, sir? Now, let's see. I think I'll start off place with a bowl of clam chowder. Chowder, sir. A large porterhouse steak smothered with onions. Yes, sir. A baked potato, diamond beans, buttered beets, a combination salad. Now, for dessert, I think I'll have a double portion of apple pie with a large piece of American cream cheese. Yes, sir. And a flagon of coffee. <laughs> I'll have the same. Yes, sir. You can't have the same. Why can't I have the same? Because you've got to fight tonight. One order. Why, certainly. I thought you were the boss. I'm the manager. I thought the boss was going to be the boss. I thought he was going to be the boss. I thought the boss was going to be the boss.
this. Well, I'll bet you ten dollars to one that Muggsy Long wins. I'll take five dollars. It's a bet. In this corner, we have Muggsy Long. <laughs> and in this corner, a newcomer to these fights. Battling Laurel. Do you understand the rules of this fight? You fight the straight market between very rules. Take yourself at all times. Take it to command the referee. No holding. You understand that? All right, boys. Go to it. <laughs> Double-crossed me. Oh! Oh! 